One of the biggest mistakes I see new investors making is getting into a deal and then losing control of that deal. You never want to lose control of the transaction. You always want to be in control. And here's an example of what I'm talking about. Most people think that at the end of the 30th day, if we're doing a 30-day inspection period, at the end of the 30th day, then we go into the financing contingency. And at that point, you still can get out of the deal. Yes, you can, but only conditionally so. You might have uh, end up getting the financing, but not being able to find all the down payment money. Well, guess what? You satisfy the financing contingency, but you didn't close on the deal, so you lose your earnest money. You've lost control of the transaction. Let me give you another example. Worst situation is when you're trying to do an assumption. And assumptions are, are so tricky. People may make them seem like they're easy and they're the best way to go. Personally, I hate assumptions. Worst way to buy a property. But let's say you get yourself into an assumption deal. The problem with an assumption is that there's a third party at the negotiating table, and that's the bank. And they don't care about your contract. They don't care about your time frame. They're going to work on their own time frame. Let's say, for instance, you negotiated a transaction where you only had to put 10% down to assume that particular mortgage. Bravo to you. And you go through the whole due diligence period and the whole financing period, and your money is hard, and you've got the 10% sitting in the bank, and all of a sudden the bank comes back and says, hey, you know that deal? Um, we don't like the fact that you're only putting 10% down. We think you should have a little bit more skin in the game. And you look at them like, what are you talking about? I've, I've negotiated this contract. We can't change the terms now. The bank says, oh, well, what we want you to do is just take an additional 10% and just stick it in our bank. So we know you, you're good for the 20% down. Well, that totally changes everything. But you're stuck. Your money's already hard. You're like five days before the close. What do you do? You've just lost control of the deal. And what you need to do as a new investor is, first off, contact us because we can help you through, through these types of things and anticipate the problems that you'll have. But there are ways to protect yourself from that type of thing happening, and that is because you put provisions in the contract early on in anticipation of things going wrong. And that's how you always remain in control of the deal.